Hey friends, welcome back. This is my week in review. I do this every week so that I can uh, share my my wins and my mistakes and also have some accountability in the public sphere so that I try to make uh, the right decisions here. So let's start off with uh, what happened last week. I had uh, a position on in DWAC, which has a really high premium, but it's a pretty high risk stock. It's a new company and uh, some things going on with it that I didn't really like uh, after some more research. So I decided to buy to close and uh, I had collected, collected quite a bit of premium. So I was okay closing it uh, you know, with a cost of $28. So the result is $75 in premium that I was collected for that. So I'm putting that behind me. Next, I had a position in U, Unity Software, and I decided to roll that out. It cost me six bucks. So the premium collected originally was 33. Uh, the result result is 27. And I rolled that out. So I uh, rolled it out to the 16th. Rolled it down a little bit to collect a little bit more premium. My cost of acquisition was 35. So I don't, don't really want to uh, let it go at this. But I can hopefully, if it gets close to that, I can roll it. But I collected a $50 premium there. I'm going to look at my option for you. It's still, as a call, it's still pretty much... Uh, out of the money so still looking good for that at, at the end of this week so the next thing is a snap here this really went against me I had originally sold a uh, cash secure put at 1450 with the current price of 1750 and just went way down so let's look at uh, snap and I made the mistake again of uh, making an option move during earnings week big mistake the stock was trading at uh, 1746 and it went down like 31% to 1199 and it's just been uh, bumping along down there ever since. So it would have cost me way too much to uh, buy it back. So I'm kind of stuck with it. And hopefully it goes up. Hopefully I can sell covered calls against it as it goes up or as it sits. But you can see here I was assigned uh, Snap at 14.50. And right now, let's see what it is. 14.50, it's currently selling at uh, 11.16. So 14.50. 50 minus 1116 so I'm down 334 on that on paper it's not a realized loss so I'm still up technically by this amount on my options this week or this month so hopefully that'll eventually work out if not then a you know, lesson learned folks don't uh, trade options during earnings the next thing I did was uh, sold a covered call on AI strike price at 27 current price was $24.95 at the time. Let's go look at my option there. AI call. That's uh, currently sitting at $28.60 and my uh, strike price is $27. So that might get called away. We'll see what happens at the end of this week. But if it does, that's okay. I can just do uh, cash secured puts on it again. Maybe acquire the stock, maybe not. It's a fun one to play with. The next move I did was sell a cash secured put on AI and uh, trying to get this at a strike price of 24 the current price at the time was 2602 I thought I could maybe reduce the the uh, average cost of the uh, original 100 shares I bought so if I bought another 100 shares at 24 I bought these originally at uh, 30 so that would kind of reduce my average cost so that's in progress collected $30 premium for that I added a uh, cash secured put on a stock called NEE expires 216s all of these right now are, are expiring 216 strike price of 54 and current price of 56 let's see what the current price is now 5662 so that's looking pretty good it's out of the money and the next thing I did was I rolled that TQQQ out uh, from 29 to 216 and rolled it rolled it up to um, strike price of 55 that's in process. I collected a $57 premium. So let's look at that TQQQ. It's sitting at $60.29 and the current strike price $55. So it's looking really good there. So these things are looking pretty good. The market's been good to me except for that uh, snap. Everything's set to expire uh, this coming Friday. So I'm just going to let these roll for a little bit. I'll make some moves next week. But that's pretty much my week in review. Some wins and some losses. And uh, total collected so far this month is $403.
And that's it. I hope you enjoy this video. Please like and subscribe if you did. And we'll see you on the next one.